Hola, uh, this is a video on creating a model from already segmented vessels. So I've already created um, a bunch of different surfaces for the example data set online. And I'm going to create a model of, from a couple of these. Uh, and the way we do this is we select our 2D group surface, or if you've done 3D segmentation, your 3D segmented surface, um, and go over here to model operations, use surface. And so I'm going to do that for my aorta and my iliac. And so this says, hey, I want to use these two surfaces for my model. And so I'm going to go here to the model tab, uh, the default tab here is polydata, and that's what I'm going to create mine with. Um, you can see there's a bunch of different lofting options here. Uh, if your version doesn't have this, you can update to the most recent version, or you can find the same exact parameters here under lofting parameters. This kind of just changes the interpolation between the segmentations you've created. And so I'm just going to go here and I click create pre-op solid, mo solid model. I'm going to call this aorta. And we wait for it to loft and boolean these vessels together. And then once that done, that's done, we can see it's created our model. And we can click here. We have a cat for our aorta. Um, we have a second cat because if you've watched any other videos, uh, we created a path and a vessel all the way along here. And so this is the other cap there, uh, cap of the right iliac. And then we have the wall of our aorta and the wall of our right iliac. Um, if we want to change how these uh, surfaces are lofted, we can do that here. Say for some reason we don't want it to be as uh, uh, discrete. We, if you click E on the screen, you can kind of see uh, all the different triangles we created on our surface, and that's based on the circumferential sampling here and the long longitudinal sampling along the length. And it's pretty fine if we want it a coarser version of this. We can, you know, um, do less, say 30 and 6, um, and then we can just create pre op solid model again. And the weight that shows up, as you can see, it's coarser than our previous one. And so you can kind of play with how fine or coarse you want this. Uh, and this is uh, kind of just dependent on what you and what you want to do. If you just want a simple representation of the image data, maybe coarse is good enough. If you're going to try to create a really fine volumetric mesh, then you probably want a, a fine uh, surface as well. And so then uh, we can also change and add Fourier modes. Um, this will loft it differently. And we can do create pre op solid model. Uh, and so that gives us a slightly different look to our vessels. Um, so that's something you can look at as well, but once again we can select our different surfaces with P uh, in the 3D window, or you can highlight them here and they will highlight in the window here. Um, so that's all I have to show you here. Um, if you have any questions, go ahead and post here in the forums uh, and we can get that worked out. Um, so, alright, thanks!